Here it is. We are cleaned up and we're ready for the first renters and it's all painted and clean. So let's go see it. As I think through the project, it's nice to get to the end and I get on to thinking about the next thing. But this project, it's neat in that ministry is going to happen here from now on. And that's what the exciting part about Seacrest is. It's a place to rest. It's a place to meet God. It's a place to grow. We just walked into the lodge and you can remember back in uh, February when all the contractor tools were here. We had boards everywhere. Now it's clean again. For those that have many memories, you know this room. The new furniture should be arriving shortly. You know, I've said it every time, the ocean view. God makes it perfect every day. And we've had the opportunity for the last five months to watch. Even in the storms, that ocean is beautiful. Thank you, the Lord. We used to have glass doors and an outside porch. Now we have two new bathrooms and we got the other one with the bathtub. And of course, then we have the door that goes out on the deck. Just like at home, we have uh, many projects that can continue. Deck needs probably a new deck pretty soon. And we have a lot of landscaping we can do. We do have the Boy Scout group coming over in July to help work on the path. That's exciting. And here's one of our bedrooms set up with its bunk bed and its queen bed. And it has its bench and hangers for hanging your clothes on. This is the smallest room we have. The rest of them are a little bigger. These are all pretty much the same. You can see we have the mirrors all up. The showers are all in. The rain heads are on. It looks great. You still have the rustic wood. Came off the old walls. We put it right back on. Our exit lights are in. It's a new lodge. And for a lot of us, here's the puzzles. Here's the games. We have to remember all the volunteers that were here. It's been uh, just an exciting time. When I think of Seacrest, I realize it's a gift from God. Go back into the 60s when those individuals helped us catch the vision for what can happen when we buy this retreat center. But actually, it's a tool of God, a gift that becomes a tool that he's entrusted to us as a church. Countless people will give their lives to Christ at this retreat center. Multitudes more will make significant decisions Families will be connected. Disciples will be made. Relationships strengthened. This tool that God has given to us that we have recently invested in will invest back into us as a church. And we will see the gospel presented, neighbors strengthened and loved, disciples made, and out of that, a culture that moves more towards the heart of God. Seacrest is a gift from God, but it's a tool, and we get the opportunity to use that tool and to steward it for the glory of Christ.